What's up, Raf gang? Welcome back. It's back in the Raf cave for another reaction. Today was the Xbox Developers Direct, and of course, one of the two games that I'm looking forward to on Xbox this year is Senua's Hellblade 2, and of course, Indiana, which we'll get to later. But now, this game here, oh, it's been a long time coming. Ever since the first trailer, the announcement launch trailer of Xbox, Xbox Series S, X and X, was uh, Senwa, and uh, she looked great. Now, a few videos have come and all these things. Now let's see the meat of a trailer and also get that uh, release date, which is, I believe, this May. Xbox Game Pass, let's go. All right, let's check it out. Thanks for watching, guys. Hit that like button, subscribe, hope you're doing well. Thank you for watching the reactions with me. Looking forward to this game, big time. Let's go, Xbox. Ninja House. Ninja Theory, oh yes. Hi, I'm Don Matthews, studio head here at Ninja Theory in Cambridge, UK. We're now in the final months of development on Senua Saga Hellblade 2. Final months. And the team is working hard to bring you an unforgettable journey into Senua's unique world and her battle for survival, where we have once again combined high fidelity and immersive presentation with a shorter narrative-led experience that focuses on the things that we really care about and that we hope you care about too. Just give me a 20 plus hour experience at least. Damn, this looks so good. Now is this a CG cutscene? She wants to stop the Vikings who raided her village right at their source in Iceland. But not just her quest has She's changed. She's been great as Senua. Senua herself Those has eyes. grown since the first Hellblade. She's made peace with her past and is no longer in such fear of her visions and voices. While the Furies are still her constant companions, that studio that she films. encounters new people along the way, some of which will value her unique perspective and others who will reject it. Wow, look at that nip. Little the lip bite. Nip. Lip bite. This settlement. Facial animations. Insane. Became my tribe. In the game, Senua arrives in 10th century Iceland on the trail of Is this game letterbox or in the story we're trying to be as faithful to history as we can up We're going to have that option or what? Establishing a solid framework and then building It's like another order 1866 1886 game. Two giants who have plunged the land into chaos and which in turn has seen the rise of the Joiga, a violent threat that has swept through the settlements that she'll discover. <laughs> Senua will make new enemies and yeah, I better see more blood spray than that. God damn me. See her unique perspective Cut the leg off, I better see some blood spraying. She'll discover along with us how this viewpoint can have its advantages. Yo, this better be full screen. I mean, presentation is cool to have letterbox, but come on. Senua is a None of our TVs warrior, look like that unless you're a PC psychosis. gamer. Seeing you know, things monitor, that other people ultra don't, wide. hearing voices and having unique beliefs about the world around her. To bring Senua's perspective of the world to life in a truthful way, we have once again worked closely with Professor Paul Fletcher at the University of Cambridge, as well as people with lived experience of psychosis. What does that mean? What does that mean? Get your headphones ready. Players will find themselves traversing beautiful and hostile environments. Seeking answers from patterns and signs that Senua sees in her own unique way and battling through encounters with enemies that will push Senua to her limits Mash the A button <laughs> It's all in your head we've taken everything to the next level With a new motion capture space a bigger stage team a stunt crew and a new cast we spent a lot of time planning the motion capture shoots, thinking of what events would be good to bring into this fight. Like, how can we make this fight feel different from the previous fight? We have all new combat for the sequel. Yes, give me that combat. Oh, come on. One of our key goals was There's a couple drops of blood fly off. Come on. Stories, right? it, it does feel Damn. Very different from the first Smack game, that. But it's very brutal and come on please up the blood spray when you have a sword and you're slicing body parts survival, and we want the player to feel her struggle in every step of her journey we want the player to always feel like i hope that i hope the fighting's a little just sped up just a little bit i mean i love the cinematic no, no, fighting Senua, but turn up the speed just a do, notch 
her instincts are amazing and she really doesn't need much help from me. On no, stage, she's a seasoned veteran. She knows what's going on. So I get to watch the actors Follow and see all the lead. beautiful expressions on their faces. And then I have to wait a little while and then I get to see that all again in game, in costume, on location, everything. It's, it's a great experience, a great process. Every discipline in the studio is unified in achieving a deep level of immersion. That looks amazing. And pull you into Love the graphics. Hands down, incredible. We were of lucky course. enough to do a few reference gathering trips in Iceland. You have to be there. The, the sense of scale, everything is incredible. Mm -hmm. And you see a scene or you see a small section of the game and you're like, yeah, that, that works. That's amazing. Senua experiences reality differently, and a part of this manifests in the voices she hears. She will collapse. She will. It's gonna be all over your ears. These voices come to life through binaural audio. Give me some Dolby Atmos. A good representation of this type of auditory hallucinations. As we focus in immersion, uh, binaural audio is perfect for this because through headphones, you surround yourself in a three-dimensional space. Of course. In the first game, we only apply to the voices that Senua listens in her head. In this game, through a special audio technology and uh, some extra little things within the game, there is music that is binaural. Every single sound has the potential to be binaural, so everything is specialized around you, and it's a very beautiful experience. Looking forward to it. My Razer Navi Ultimate won't let me down. Music is a strange language in the sense that it speaks to our emotions fast and deep. It's not only about quality, it's about personality. So when you listen to Hellblade, you know it's Hellblade. On the music, we are working with Hailun, which for me is a personal privilege because I really admire them. Okay, let's not have copyright music in this trailer. La la la, I'm sure it's really wonderful. Something really special. Okay, wonderful music, yes, okay. Right, right. And our very own theories they sing so beautiful and we add that binaural touch of music so this all creates a very immersive and yeah, a very SMR. special and unique Come experience our mission here at ninja theory is to craft life-changing art with game-changing tech and that's our aim in senua saga this unreal 5 right too is to not only see where Senua goes next, but to deliver something really meaningful for our players. My hope is that they will really connect to Senua as a character, and even if they can't really relate to what she's going through, maybe they know someone that relates to that character and they can then understand that person better. Well, <clears throat> I don't want to sound cheesy, but in a way I'm Senua, right? She exists and doesn't. It exists through all of her work, through every ninja. So. We all are Senua, and we are creating this character that grows and grows and grows and grows and keep growing and keep changing. So that makes it real. I'm so mm -hmm. proud of the love, care, and passion our team here at Ninja Theory are putting into Senua's saga Hellblade 2. Our hope is to not only create a game that is great to play, but to craft an experience that leaves you thinking and feeling. From our combat gameplay through to our action set Please make the combat spectacular. That'll make solving. this game just so much, in much better. Senua's journey. A journey that you can embark on on May 21st. May 21st. The date confirmed. PC and Game Pass, of course. Amazing. All right. Launch date, May 21st. Series X and S. Mm. PC and Game Pass, which is awesome. Can't wait, guys. Definitely be playing this game day one right here on my channel live stream, of course. So definitely check it out. Thanks for watching, guys. Hit that like button, subscribe. See you in the next one. Home Theater Rules. Wrap out. See you guys.